So for joint immobilization, for this part, we're going to uh, pretend that the wrist is the joint that's infect er, impacted here. So first thing we're going to do before we treat, we're always going to make sure BSI is seen safe. Uh, I have my gloves on and the scene does look safe. All right, sir, what happened? I was running, chasing after my friend after he pranked me and I fell. Okay. Can I see your wrist? All right, we're going to start looking at the wrist, see if there's anything protruding, if we need to cover it with gauze. This just looks like a deformity, so what we're going to do, first thing we're going to do is we're going to check the PMSCs. So we're going to check for his pulse. We're going to check it right here. We're also going to check the other arm since this is the arm that's affected. We're going to check his motor scrolls. Sir, can you wiggle your fingers? We're going to look for his uh, circulation here. And uh, can, you t uh, can you look that way and tell me what finger I'm touching? Middle. Perfect. Okay. So PMSCs all seem to be intact, so we're going to start splinting it. So either with the patient or with my other hand or my partner supporting the injured wrist, I'm going to get the materials I need. So I'm going to, thank you. So I'm going to, um, there's a couple different ways you can do this. These SAM splints are big and they're foldable so you can figure out how it works best for you. In this case, I'm going to just round it a little bit so that it can go and conform to his arm. And I'm going to put this rounded edge, I'm going to use it to where he can grip it. So I'm going to lay this against his arm, and if he can, rotate it like this. I'm going to help conform a little bit more of it to his arm. And is this at a good resting position for you? Yeah. Okay. Once that's good, we're going to start wrapping it, and we're going to always start below and start working up. And we'll just wrap not too tight to cut off circulation, but enough to secure the splint to his arm. Okay. And then you can seal this off with tape or some of them are self-adhesive. Is that comfortable? Okay, now uh, once we're done with that, we're going to reassess all of our PMSCs. So we're going to check for a pulse, which sometimes you can get through here. I'm going to check there with the circulation. I want to check the other hand as well, just to make sure. Um, motor <coughs> skills, can you wiggle your fingers still? Perfect. Can you tell me what finger I'm holding? Pinky. And then I'm going to check his circulation again one more time. And that is joint immobilization. <laughs>